हेलो व्यूवर्स इन टूडेज वीडियो आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट पोटेंशियल साइड इफेक्ट ऑफ द कोविड नाइन्टीन वैक्सीन व्यूवर्स ईयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी विल बी रिमेम्बर्ड एज अ कोविड ईयर कोविड नाइन्टीन इट इमर्ज फ्रॉम स्ट्रीट ऑफ वुहान चाइना एंड इट स्प्रेड टू ऑलमोस्ट एवरी स्ट्रीट अक्रॉस द वर्ल्ड इट हैज बिन मोर देन वन ईयर एंड दिस कोविड नाइन्टीन हैज कॉज सो मेनी डेथ सोशल डिस्टेंसिंग साइकोलॉजिकल इशूज it has affected people lives their health jobs financial statuses economic crisis all over the world several corona virus vaccines have now been approved for use either by the individual countries or by the who and european union there are currently more than 60 covid-19 vaccine candidates in trials currently two most important vaccines that are authorized and they are recommended for use in the covid-19 they are pfizer's biontech covid-19 vaccine and moderna's covid-19 vaccine large scale phase 3 clinical trials are also in progress for three covid-19 vaccines in united states these are astrazeneca's covid-19 vaccine johnson's covid-19 vaccine novavax covid-19 vaccine Several other vaccines are also in phase three clinical trials, like Sputnik V, Epivac coronavirus vaccine, Coronavac, Sinovac, Covaxin. New vaccines are emerging for prevention of the COVID-19. It is said that a new vaccine made by the Johnson and Johnson is the first one to prove effective with just one single dose. Now. COVID-19 vaccines actually help our body to develop immunity to the virus that causes the COVID-19 without us having the acute illness different types of the vaccines are working in different ways to offer protection but with all type of the vaccines the body is left with the supply of memory T lymphocytes and B lymphocytes as well as antibodies and these T lymphocytes and B lymphocytes and antibodies they will remember how to fight the virus in the future it typically takes a few weeks for the body to produce t lymphocytes and b lymphocytes after vaccination so sometimes after vaccination the process of building immunity can cause some symptoms like body aches fever muscle pains fatigue etc etc these symptoms are basically normal and they are a sign that our body is working and it is building immunity so it is very important to know about minor side effects of the covid-19 vaccine and some very rare but serious side effects of the covid-19 vaccine viewers it is important to understand how vaccines work actually vaccines work by introducing a small number of either a bacteria virus or a toxin into your body because this virus bacteria or toxin has been killed or it is weakened so there is no risk of contracting the active disease but what our body will do our body will respond as it is under attack and it will start building an immune response against those viruses bacteria or toxins which is introduced into your body so in the near future if you have encountered the disease you will have an army of the cells and antibodies readily available in your body to fight against that disease so adverse effects are not caused by the virus or the toxin it is basically by your body's immune response which is fighting against the invader sometimes after the vaccination the process of uh, building immunity in our body it can cause some symptoms like body aches fever muscle pain fatigue etc so these symptoms are normal and they are a sign that our body is working and it is building immunity against the foreign particle so it is very important to know about the minor side effects of the covid-19 vaccine as well as the rare but very serious side effects so expected and minor side effects of the covid-19 vaccine would be pain at the injection site fatigue tiredness headaches chills swollen lymph nodes myalgias joint pains fever redness and swelling at the injection site Serious side effects of the COVID-19 vaccine are very rare. Rate is very very less in contrast to the devastating effect of the COVID-19 which COVID-19 has caused worldwide. Allergic reactions are 1 to 2 cases per million vaccinations across the world. What we need to understand is basically the risk versus benefits analysis. 
that is how many people worldwide are dying from covid-19 versus how many people are died from any serious adverse effects of the vaccine so adverse effects are uh, although very tragic for the individual but they are very very rare serious allergic reaction is very rare and it may occur within a few minutes to 1 hour so uh, it is recommended that vaccination provider will ask you to stay for at least 1 hour to monitor you for any serious allergic reactions if any serious allergic reaction happen then what would be the symptoms of that serious allergic reaction patient can have difficulty in breathing fast heart beat swelling in the throat a skin rash which is generalized all over the body extreme dizziness extreme weakness now in the last uh, one common question which everyone asked that can covid-19 vaccine cause covid so the answer to this question is a big no it is not possible to contract covid-19 disease from the covid-19 virus vaccine because none of the covid-19 vaccines which are available or which are in uh, phase 3 clinical trials they contains active sars covid-19 So viewers I hope that uh, I was able to answer most of your queries do tell me in comment section if you want to know anything specific about covid-19 covid-19 virus vaccines if you like my video do hit the like button and subscribe my channel thank you thank you for listening stay blessed stay safe